He is an absolute uh, treasure, and I, I please make him welcome, J.P. Cormier. Well, this is an interesting night. You don't see this often. I still remember uh, meeting Duncan <laughs> all those years ago. I used to watch Duncan on the Tommy Hunter show. I love that. And uh, I remember uh, that particular tour. We played in, uh, in Timmins. And <laughs> when I got up to uh, north of Toronto there for the rehearsals with Tom's band, he gave me a whole bunch of his records. I already had a bunch, but he gave me more. And uh, one of the records he gave me was called The Moon Man Newfie. And I had to learn how to play uh, penny whistle and whiffle board. Penny whistle for the Moon Man Newfie and whiffle board I played on Rubberhead. He cut me this big piece of brass sheet metal and I had to stand in front of a microphone and go waka 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 during Rubberhead. It was the pinnacle of my playing career. But there was one song on that record Near the end of the tape was a cassette of those days. And I heard it, and I absolutely fell in love with the song. I couldn't stop listening to it, and I was playing it and playing it and playing it. I had, a, I had a Walkman. I had this thing on repeat. Just kept rewinding it. And when we got to Timmins, Tim, uh, Stomp and Tom told me this was the, the first 45 single I ever cut was that song. I said, well, why don't you sing it tonight? And uh, I'll never forget it. Out of 70 shows we played across Canada, it was the only time that he ever broke down in the middle of the song. And it was the most emotional thing I ever saw in my life. I'll never forget it as long as I live. And uh, the whole band was crying, the audience was crying, he was crying. It was something else. And so years later, I recorded it, took it down to his house, and he put it on his jukebox. And we listened to it 400 times. And drank 37,000 beers. And played darts and chess until 9 o'clock in the morning. And I never won once. So this is for Tom. a wild goose who from the Southland flew in a V-shaped flock of wild geese with her lover Gander Goo, her lover Gander Goo. They flew across North Michigan to see the sights below, for they were on their honeymoon to North Ontario, to North Ontario. Honk honk said a little wah wah, honk honk my gander goo, and goose talk that means I love you and always will be true, always will be true. Little wah wah, little wah wah. The night was fast approaching, a deadly sing sound. Was an arrow from an Indian's bow and Gandergoo shot down. Gandergoo fell down. The wild geese kept on flying, but Wawa would not go. She stayed to find her lover in the bushlands far below. In the bushland far below. Honk honk said a little Wawa. Honk honk my Gandergoo. In goose talk that means I love you and always will be true. Always will be true. Little Wawa. Little Wawa. Thank you. 
died of heartbreak, a legend she became. But now she'll live forever in a town that bears her name. In a town that bears her name. So if you see her statue on Highway 17, you'll know that you're in Wawa, and her love song you will sing. Her love song you will sing. Honk, honk, said little Wawa, honk, honk, my gander goo. If you're stuck, that means I love you, and I always will be true. I always will be true. Little Wawa. One step upon the lonely road And you were on your way An ancient heart that bore a heavy load You were just thirteen and became a man And a vagabond, they say A minstrel and a beggar you would be Roving through the land He wrote about each special memory And the stories of this country Came to life beneath your hand And you built this house of plywood With a boot heel and a pen A line of ink that stretches Across the country and back again through the sawdust and the spotlight, your words still linger on. Last night I dreamed that Canada was a song by a stomping tongue. The people and the places in your songs became your battle cry. Live or die, whether right or wrong You raised the flag before us And we saw it through your eyes Some men stumble beneath the weight of fame But your steps were true You changed the rules so we could win the game and you held us all above you right until the song was through. And you built this house of plywood with a boot heel and a pen. A line of ink that stretches across the country and back again. Through the sawdust and the spotlight, your words still linger on. Last night I dreamed that Canada was a song by Stompin' Tom. It takes a mighty man to bear his heart and admit he numbers not someone who is no one from the start. Cause sometimes being nothing is the best thing that we've got And you built this house of plywood With a boot heel and a pen A line of ink that stretches Across this country and back again Through the sawdust and the spotlight Your words still linger on Last night I dreamed of Canada was a song by a stomping tongue. This nation's just a song, 
a song by Stompin' Tom. We're all just a song, a song by Stompin' Tom. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Well, I've been in some interesting positions in my life. This is the strangest one ever. I, uh, of course, came here tonight because uh, Tom Connors was like a father to me. and. Uh, I'm sure that uh, Lena could tell you stories, but the very first time I, I ever sat at their kitchen table and I was so poor, I had no money, never had any money, and we were just getting ready to go out on tour and Tom said, here's 500 bucks and go get yourself some clothes, and he threw $500 of cash on me at the dining room table, and I sat there and looked at it and I started to cry. And Lena looked at me and said, what's the matter? And I said, I never saw this much money in my life. <laughs> And I did, I was caught, and Tom just looked at me, he didn't know what to think. And, uh, but those memories are forever with me. And... <laughs>